Hello everyone, in today's video we are going to talk about how to install Python 3.11 and pip on Windows 10 11. Myself Mohammed Zubair and this channel is all about showing you how to become a highly paid IT pro really fast. So without any further ado, let's get started. Well, the process of downloading and installing Python in Windows 10 and 11 is same. So for the sake of this video, I'll stick with Windows 10 and you can follow the same process for your Windows 11 as well. So first of all, we need to download our Python. So head to the official website and go to your download section. Here we have a button that says download Python 3.11.2. So I'll just click on this button and let's download our Python. We are done with the download and now it's time to install our python let's just click on this open button and from here we have two options either we can install it or we can customize the installation in case if we have a previous version available into our system after that down here we have two other options make sure to select the second one as well that says add python.exe to path because in our system we have different paths available for different environment variables so it will install and it will add your python into your environment variable on its own so i'll just click on it and from here click on customize installation because i want to explain some of the options in here we have documentation pip python test suite py launcher and some other option and as we also want to install pip so make sure that you have selected this option as well after that click on next and here we have some other things so in case let's say you have more than one user onto your system and you want to install python for all of them click on the first option that says install python 3.11 for all users or in case if you are the only one that use this system you can leave this option as it is let's go for this option so let's just click on it and down here we have the directory where our python is going to get installed you can change this directory as well now i'll just click on this install button and the installation process has just begun it will take a few minutes to complete the process so let's just wait for it and then i'll show to you that if it got installed or not we are done with the installation and now let's just close this one and now in order to check if python got installed or not we have several ways either you can search for python directly into your system and as you can see it is showing python then down here we have module docs and we have idle let's just open this one and it's the editor for python and let's try to run some of the commands and let's see if python is working or not so i'll write here print and in that i'll write skills build space training and let's just close this one and let's try to run and let's see if it is working or not so let's just save it first and here you can see we have successfully got the output it means python has been installed successfully and it is working pretty fine let's just close this one and let's see some other ways open your command prompt here it is i'll just open this one and here i'll write python space hyphen hyphen version hit enter and python 3.11 has been installed there is another way just right here pi space hyphen hyphen version hit enter and here you can see we have the output now in order to check if pip got installed or not i'll write here py or pi space hyphen m space pip space hyphen hyphen version and let's hit enter and here we have the output that shows that pip got installed successfully as well along with the python so this is how you can install python 3.11 in your windows 10 and 11 along with installation of your pip and that brings me to the end of this particular video i hope now that you must have liked and loved watching this one and if that is the case do leave a like subscribe and press the bell icon I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Till the next video, take care.